But first up and our top story on this Monday at noon, Colorado Springs Mayor John Southers announcing today that he will allow the curfew order to expire. News 5's Jessica Bretto live for us downtown right now and just finish up speaking with the mayor. What's the scene like down there? And Jessica, what did the mayor have to say? Good afternoon, Ira, and good afternoon, everyone. That's right, we just got done talking to the mayor. He has decided not to extend that curfew. Remember, that curfew was in place starting Wednesday, 10 p.m., expired this morning at 5 a.m., and he says what went into his decision-making is that the peaceful protests that we've seen in the past five days have not led to any widespread crimes. Now, remember, widespread crimes, that's the key word, because even though these past few days weren't without some incidents, we do want to point out that he said there were no widespread crimes compared to what we saw in the days prior, with multiple windows being smashed, multiple places around the city being tagged with spray paint. And a lot of folks believed, a lot of folks who were protesting believed that we didn't need a curfew in the first place. But take a listen to what Mayor Southers had to say about that. A curfew was needed because we needed to uh, turn it around. We had four consecutive nights of problems. After the curfew, we've had uh, five consecutive days and nights uh, without problems. And so we'll continue without the curfew until such time as any conduct causes us to rethink. Mayor also adding that to his knowledge, no citations were given out for violation of this curfew because he points out police officers weren't really out to give out citations. They were understanding that a few protesters were out late, especially around 10 o'clock, so they weren't actively handing these citations out. Now, we do want to point out that he also shared with us he is a little nervous but optimistic. Going into today, there are some protests scheduled for today. In fact, we know of one happening at City Hall right now, so we plan to bring you more updates on that. Always watching out for you, Colorado Springs, Jessica Barreto, News 5.